The five pole flat connector that we're using here to ease our installation for the trailer wiring is part number 20017. All right, so we're gonna convert our trailer over to a five pole signal here, five flat. This is specific for boat trailers because you have the blue wire here, which is the signal for reverse for your uh, trailer brake lockout solenoid. So we'll strip off a quarter inch of this blue wire here. And we'll install it into our butt connector here that goes to our solenoid for hydraulic brake actuators. It is part number DM11993. And we'll crimp it into place. We can hook up the rest of our wires to where they go based upon our connection here. I'm gonna take our old connection here and cut off these zip ties to separate our wires so we can access them a little bit easier. Now we're gonna start with what's our green wire. Strip back about a quarter of an inch. We're measuring off where we need to trim back our green wire. Okay, right about there. We'll cut the excess off of our green wire. Strip back about a quarter of an inch. Install our butt connectors. Now we'll take the brown wire for our right side and we'll do that one next and then we'll do the same for the other wires. Okay, with all of our electrical connections made now, we can use our heat source, seal our heat shrink butt connectors up. To help tidy up our wires, I'm gonna take some electrical tape here and wrap around our wires, just so we don't have a lot hanging down. And this will make a nice clean install. So now we've done that, we can actually go hook it up to our truck and go down the lake and enjoy our boat. And that completes the installation of the five pole flat connector part number 20017.